Hey guys and girls, welcome back to another beautiful video on this beautiful channel, on this beautiful day. How you guys and girls doing? Hope you're doing great as always. Please check out the description box for all the nice links. Also drop a like, subscribe if you like the content. So here we are. We're going to have to try to somehow make sure all of this works. Now let me just close all documents just to make a clean slate here. And let's start off with enemy spawner, okay? So what I'm going to do today is to make sure loading and everything works fine. Now, the format I'm going to do this in, I'm going to try to comment that in here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do the tile type, the um, rect x, rect y. Um, and then we need to simultaneously look at how tile map loads it so we kind of specify the way it loads it right so let's just go into tile map and keep this open right here the loading the loading where was it did i miss it load from let's just focus on this right now so we need to look at this okay so what it does is checks the type so the type should always be first we do have that type is first okay the next thing is going to check for tile map right here the next thing is it's already taken in type here remember that it's already taken in type so if the type was enemy spawner okay we're in here so it's going to start with the x y and z of uh, the tile um la, 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 la. let's see how let's see how this does it x y and z okay that saves automatically when we save it so let's just go ahead and look at that okay no stress no, no stress what's get what's going on here so what happens what happens what happens before we get a string what happens the out file make sure all of this is saved okay out file prints out x y and the z and then get a string so x type uh, x y and z done in tile map save done in uh, where was it uh, yeah tile map save okay and then hold on hold on hold on, hold on. that's first and then x y and z and then type now rectangle x y let's go back we can always go back and check XYZ and then this go back to the loading let's see now uh, XY XYZ what layer okay okay hmm that's interesting we don't use that Z right there uh, oh hold up Hold on, hold on, I messed it up, I messed it up, obviously, we need that, oh my god, what if I had missed that shit, my god, could have been real bad, okay, I would have been wondering for days what the hell happened, so that's why we use the Z, and then we save X and Y, um, very good, very good, X, Y, And then grid size F and tile sheet. That's good. That's good. Grid size F and tile sheet. Texture rectangle. That's all done. Uh, grid size F is saved. Tile sheet is saved. This is the next thing. Okay, so this is the next thing. Uh, tile type and collision is set automatically. So this is the next thing. Type AM TTS MD. So we need to save all of those after basically. So enemy type uh, enemy what was it? Amount time to spawn enemy time to spawn enemy time to spawn enemy max distance okay so those are the things we need to push out and this enemy 
type this enemy amount this enemy max no time to spawn this enemy no why do i keep doing that why enemy max distance okay so once that's done the type left top enemy blah 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 okay so the function is uh, the type was saved i need to write it here just so i don't forget type is saved xyz this is it type is it okay all right so this is the loading of it type is always loaded first no way hold on hold on this is not gonna work is it hold on right quick how does this work so so it saves the xyz positions first so what has to be done is we need before we can even get type um we need to get xyz xyz right that should work right so xyz type and once we have type we can check and then we'll get texture rectangle x y enemy type enemy amount okay all right all right all right xyz type rectangle enemy type amount all right all right all right that stuff isn't saved okay that's good that's good it's real good that's real good okay xyz we don't need xyz here either okay just trx try and collision okay collision very nice very nice now let's go to tile let's just make sure tile is doing it right type texture left right collision good shit good shit very easy very easy all right so i hopefully you followed me on all that um, am i even recording all that beautiful stuff thank god okay okay so what is the next step let's think together okay put, put our minds together um we are now i think done with the loading i know this is not gonna work i know it already but you know what it doesn't matter at least we tried we just make sure to close that file as well so enemy spawner okay fine let's just leave that for a second let's go up here to save oh wait we're still in loads of oh shit okay um hold on hold on hold on hold on hold on okay yeah doesn't matter we'll keep that there um here saves the entire other format basic size xy grid size size xy grid size layers texture file okay that's good so type grid position xy layer that's good texture rectangle that's good collision and then tile specific that's good that's very good all right guys i think pretty much we're good to go i know this won't load i know you just want to see what happens i know you guys want to see what happens we'll try to load this i just want to see if it even builds first of all um this is a problem with adding new tile types you got to do all this crazy shit uh new game Ooh, this is not gonna look nice Ooh, this don't look good Ooh, this don't look good at all oof okay well that's how it goes editor can we still add stuff okay um okay okay we are adding okay okay we can add and remove okay that's very nice all right so i'm just gonna do some some normal stuff okay i'm in the minuses now let me just add some some whatever some different types of things 
and maybe some of these wall things maybe just make some collision objects here 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 and here and here no okay here and then save that and then load that okay new game oh shit okay all right it did save all of these tiles properly it looks kind of nice too it looks like some kind of dungeon okay uh editor loaded an editor that worked as well now i want to change page up okay i want to add a a few of these and i want to save that and load that okay that crashed all right so now we know now we know we're gonna have to fix this all right then we're gonna focus on that in the next one i'm pretty sure the, the solution is right in front of me but uh but yeah let's just go ahead and check that out in the next one hopefully you guys enjoyed that and it worked for you somehow at least this worked for you uh, but there you go take care guys and girls thanks for watching i'll see you in the next one right bye bye